artificial intelligence is growing at a rapid rate and changing many aspects of our lives. Like the rest of the world, our businesses and services in Africa are adopting AI to optimize their day-to-day -day operations. But how are you being impacted by AI? Should you be wary of AI? Here are some answers in our next report. Artificial intelligence, commonly referred to as AI, permeates our contemporary existence heralding an epoch characterized by exponential technological advancement. Oof. That sentence was written using ChatGBT. What I wanted to say is AI is all around us and it's one of the fastest growing forms of technology. And even here in Africa, there's over 2,400 AI organizations operating across different sectors. We're seeing a lot of AI for good use cases in Africa, AI for flood detection, AI for crop detection. According to reports, Africa's economy can be expanded by around 50% if the continent taps into just 10% of the AI market. So let's speak to these free AI experts from Africa to find out how their sector is benefiting from artificial intelligence. For us, what is important is that students have access to personalized learning journeys so they can ask particular questions in their local vernacular and the English tutor will then support them. When the student can't answer the questions, it will alert the academic staff. The difficulty is in South Africa is that not everybody has access to electricity security. We help doctors dictate their notes. We're able to help doctors complete their notes about six times faster on average. If people are able to see the doctor quicker, they get help faster. The first thing is to always remember that it is AI and it is not perfect. The AI, it's a mobile app. It's able to recommend what type of fertilizer to use. It's really a game changer for smallholder farmers on the continent. In the long term, AI would be catalytic to ensuring food security across the continent. But as we've seen recently, AI is not all good. OpenAI was founded on the belief that artificial intelligence has the potential to improve nearly every aspect of our lives, but also that it creates serious risks we have to work together to manage. Imagine a scenario where we think we're talking to a human online, but it's AI. Or you think you're listening to your favorite artist's music, but it's AI attempting to be them. And of course, the environmental aspect, the amount of energy that is used to power and build AI machines. So, should we be cautious about AI? In terms of privacy and security, you're getting privileged, private, confidential patient data, things that nobody wants to share with the world. We're ensuring that we don't even store that data longer than we need to. So remember our chat GPT definition at the beginning. It shows while AI has come to stay, human management is still key. AI is here to stay, let's embrace and use it safely.